What is good my YouTubers, it's your boy Zonzel and I'm back with another PreSonus tutorial But in this, I'm going to show you guys how to edit with Melodyne If you haven't already, subscribe to my channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button and the notification bell So every time I drop a new video, you can get the alert Alright, so in the last video, I taught you guys how to install it and how to activate it And uh, on this video, I'm going to show you guys how to use it I'm going to show you guys exactly what I do, the quick and easy way So let's get right into it, let's play what I got so far Attitude stanky, talking all crazy, acting like she never had a baby, doing shit in front of me, like I can't see it, oh my god, I can't believe it, she turns so different now, and I don't know how, probably. Alright, so as you can see, um, it needs some work, so that's pitch correction it needs work with, so what I'm gonna do, is I'm gonna go to browse. And I'm going to drag over Melodyne. And I'm going to bring it to this track, or it's right here. I got two tracks that are lead tracks, so I'm going to do it for both. I'm going to just go ahead and drag it over to the next one, too. Okay, so in order to get it on here to show up in Melodyne, I need to make sure it's before it starts. Double-click this again. Double-click this, Melodyne. And hit Transfer. So it's like a record button into there, exit out of that, go to Melodyne over here, if you only have one, then you only have one, but click this right here, exit out of that, now I'm going to go back to the first one, just double click to make sure it works, alright, now I'm going to hit space bar or play, and let's see what it does. Attitude stanky, talking all crazy, acting like she never had a baby, doing shit in front of me, like I can't see it, oh my god, I can't believe she turns so different now Let's go to the other one. And I don't know how Probably the city or people from the past Show my nigga straight up I gave her everything she asked for I played it cool, 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 cool Baby, I'm a fool, 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 fool Alright, so that's all I'm gonna do Now let's exit Before we exit, you see how that Here's how you zoom out so you can see more. You go down here and it, this thing pops up. Make sure you're on the side. And then you bring it over to hover over this these waves down here. So now you can see everything it did. All right. Same thing for over here. If you're up too much, here's the waves. You need to bring them down here. And you can make it smaller or higher from here. All right. And then I'm going to go to the other one, X, and make sure my other lead did it. Double click. Bring it down, zoom out, scoot it over. Cool. Looks like it did. So, in a nutshell, here's what I'm going to teach you guys how to do it the fast way. So, we're going to click and highlight over all this. Click and hold, highlight, and then click this, pitch correct, correct pitch macro. And this is like the quick way to do it. This is like the automatic way. And you can just go to 100 if you want to do this to 100 you can as you can see the pitch drift changes so sometimes it's good to leave that no more than 50 so I'll just do somewhere there and then let's uh, play it Attitude stanky, talking all crazy, acting like she never had a baby, doing shit in front of me, like I can't see it. Oh my god, I can't believe it. She turns so now we need to go to now that sound good. We can do some um manual things on there. Let's go to the other one, double click. Now I need to do the same thing. Highlight all this. Pitch correct macro. Bring that up to a hundred. Bring this up to like 50. But like I said, this won't always be up to 50. And by the way, you can snap it to your chord. Like right here, it automatically um, tracks what you have it in. So it has it in A minor. That's what I'm seeing in it. And it has me at 120 beats per minute. So right here, this the same tempo. But let's hit OK. And I'm not going to hit that snap to the uh, chord. Just, just because it's like the same thing. So different now And I don't know how Probably the city or people from the past Yo, my nigga straight up I gave her everything she asked for I played it cool, 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 cool 
You see how it changed that? You see how it put me back where I need to be, especially on that cool, 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 cool. Watch, I'm gonna play without it, without the melody, and just show you the difference. I gave her everything she asked for. Without it, I played it cool, 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 cool. Here's with it. I played it cool, 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 cool. So it's on key, and it don't sound like robotic, like. Auto tune, so that's what Melodyne does. Now, if you're like, okay, that's cool, but there's some of them that messed up on the automatic way. Show me the manual way. Here's the manual way. So, you make sure that this is on the main tool. You click which one that you want to change. Now, if you want to go up, you can do that. Right? Change the pitch. You're like, oh, I got it on the wrong one. Let's. See, that's a totally different key, so that's the wrong one. Now, another thing you can do if you're like, I don't want it to go to a totally different key. If you're using Windows, hold Alt, and it'll do this little thing. And then you... Right, and it won't let you go all the way up by the key. It'll just go up a little bit. I played it cool, 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 cool. Control Z. And you can go right back to where you're at. That's why I like the automatic. So, um, that's cool. So you just do that. And then another cool thing you can do is click this tool thing. And uh, you can actually cut that. So if you wanted, so go to note separation tool. And uh, you could even add a little more lines if you want. But. You can like that last cool, you can double click that and now you can cut that. Go back to the edit mode and um, you can change like that. I ain't gonna do it, but you can do that. That's. <laughs> so yeah, I mean, you can do a lot. All types of things. And there's a lot more things on here you can do. And I'm gonna show you my other videos, but I just wanted to give you a quick nutshell. That pretty much all you're doing is you're just highlighting and you're going to the correct pitch. And that's what you're doing. And since this is already done, when you click it, it'll show you something like this, that it's already done. And when you do snap to chord, see how that went up? It just puts me in A minor. That's all it does. It'll just put you in whatever chord that it read you in. So... Yeah, that's how you use it, man. If you found this video helpful, please like, subscribe, comment. Let me know anything else that you would like for me to do in my videos. If you have any questions, um, you know, we'll be more than happy to help you in the comment box. Or I'll be more than happy to help you myself. So, um, yeah, man. Appreciate the support. We out of here. Dropping content weekly. I ain't stopping. Sean Zill. Say my name. Run it up. 100K.